Thanks for stopping by artofpodcasting.com. You're watching how to set up Skype for podcasters and web show hosts. Now, this is the second video in a three-part series, and in this video, I'll show you all the settings to get the perfect Skype recording. Let's take a look at the settings inside of Skype first. Now, once you're logged inside of Skype, just hit the command comma key and that'll pull up the general menu items tab. Keep in mind, all these options right here are designed to customize the user experience, but we're only concerned with in this video how to set up and record for Skype. So we're gonna go straight to the audio video tab that's right here. And the first setting we're gonna worry about is the microphone setting. You'll want to make sure it's set to built-in input or line in that's what mine is set to now because i record on skype and this is my setting next thing where it says automatically adjust microphone settings i believe skype has this defaulted to being selected you'll want to uncheck that item because you do not want skype adjusting your mic settings we've got a mixer for that so make sure that's unchecked move down to ringing and speakers and you're gonna see the settings are exactly the same for each. We'll want built-in output or internal speakers. There'll be a bunch of settings in here. Just make sure that's where you're at. And then your volume, I usually keep mine at about 95% right here. The other thing I'll point out real quick, uh, real quick is if you look at my input volume, you'll see that I'm, I'm consistently hitting about 75% on my levels. I've really experimented around with this quite a bit, and I just find that 75% or right therein really makes for a nice, clean, crisp Skype audio call. So take that as a pointer. Your settings might be a bit different. Now that we've got Skype set up, let's head over to the mixer, and I'll show you what I've got going on over there. Okay, so I've got the mixer set up. You'll see I'm on line one these are my audio levels here and all i'm going to do is select aux one and this is the send button right here and you'll want to turn this up about four notches right about there and you're just going to move this knob to the right that's all the adjustments you have to make in there and essentially what i've done now is i have a mix minus recording set up for skype and there's just one more setting you need to be aware of, and we're gonna go into system preferences. We're gonna to go to sound, and inside of sound, select input, and on input, you need to make sure you're defaulted to your line input. That should be the line in coming from your mixer into the line input on the back of your Mac, and you'll see right here, I'm getting about 75 to 80% input volume, which is just right. It'll give me a nice clean recording. And that's pretty much the same volume that I have inside of Skype as well. So now it's time to make a test call. Okay, so here we are on Skype. The last thing we're gonna do is just make sure everything's connected. We're gonna run a Skype test call. If you don't have the Skype test call option in your menu, just go to the search window, hit echo, one, two, three. That'll bring up Skype test call. And we're listening for two things here. One, we want to make sure that we can hear our own voice back. That tells us everything's connected properly. But the other thing we're trying to determine is that our audio is clear. It's not muddy. There's no clipping because we want to make sure we're getting a good recording here. So when I hear my voice repeated back, I'm listening for actual audio quality. It's not just hearing my playback. Okay. Okay. So let's go ahead and do that. Hello, welcome to Skype call testing service. After and I'll just beep, record a sample record message a here. Message. Afterwards, your message will be played back to you. Hey, this is Quinn from artofpodcasting.com. Hopefully I've hooked up Skype correctly because everyone knows Skype is a great way to co-host, bring in extra guests in studio. Hey, this is Quinn from artofpodcasting.com. Hopefully I've hooked up Skype correctly because everyone knows Skype is a great way to co-host, bring in extra... If you are able to hear your own voice, then you have configured Skype correctly. If you hear this message, but not your own voice, then something is wrong with your audio recording setting. There you go. And the audio 
the gal uh, playing my audio back is confirmation that everything is indeed working correctly. So that's how you set up Skype for multi-track recording. This is also how you do a mix minus recording. Now, if you want to see how to do a full-on gunship show with a telephone, multiple Skype channels, background jingles, music, the whole nine yards, head on over to the website, artofpodcasting.com, and I'll show you how my show is actually set up with everything that I have here, all the channels. I'll show you all the settings because there is a bit more to it. Again, it's artofpodcasting.com. You can click on the link below to get there. Thanks for tuning in.